The past few days at uh, UBC have been very exciting. There was the Personalized Medicine Summit uh, hosted at UBC uh, with partners uh, across the province as well as involving pharmaceutical companies and healthcare providers. Peter Cullis is the director of our Personalized Medicine uh, Initiative, uh, really focused on delivering a, a roadmap uh, for personalized medicine in BC. Malcolm Grant, the chairman of the NHS Trust, uh, was one of the plenary speakers. Uh, other speakers included Gavin Stewart, Peter Cullis himself, and the Dean of Medicine, Dermot uh, Kelleher. Really proud of uh, the progress that has been made at UBC since the first summit, and we've even started to speak about perhaps having another summit at UBC. I had the honor and privilege of introducing some of the plenary speakers, including uh, my mentor, uh, Sir Malcolm Grant, uh, chairman of the NHS Trust, <coughs> who I worked for at uh, University College London, and Lee Hood, a renowned immunologist and systems biologist, really a, a pioneer in those fields, talked about um, the evolving uh, technologies, including, including transcriptome analysis, proteome analysis, and microbiome um, analyses to try to predict uh, individuals uh, before the onset of overt disease and how that, how that might uh, guide the development of pharmaceuticals and treatments, preventive uh, in many cases, uh, to really affect the quality of life uh, in uh, elderly and also in the juvenile population. Uh, he coined the term welderly, uh, hoping that uh, individuals in their, in their 80s and 90s uh, would not only be elderly but would be welderly. And he talked about the proactive nature of P4 medicine. And uh, he predicted in the next decade uh, much more of the healthcare spend would be uh, on uh, wellness as opposed to treatment of diseases once they manifest. It was great for UBC to take a leadership role in the second uh, such summit. It showcased the Life Sciences Institute and the Michael Smith Labs. All of this is the kind of thing that ought to be happening at a world-class university such as UBC.